today, y'all. I kind of wanted to do like a little vlog or whatever. Um, today, I'm on my way to work. I'm not too happy about that. Um, you know, after being at home for like, how long have I been home? For like three months? Yeah, I've been home since what? March, me? April, May, June, July. So, no, I've been home since like what? Four months, I think. <laughs> Excuse my counting. Um, yeah, so today I'm going back to work to one of my jobs because I work two jobs or whatever. I work a job um, overnight and during the day um, I have a different job that I work. So today I have a real a very, very light day. I, don't, I only have one case today so I'm going to work like four and a half four or five hours. I don't know. It depends on how I feel. And then also in the midst of working, I'm probably going to like go to, I don't know. I think I'm going to go to Marshall's or um what you call it tj maxx no i actually might go in home goods i don't know then i'm gonna go to the mall you know get something to eat and like i said in the midst of all that i'm gonna be working so hopefully y'all watch this little vlog that's if i continue to record it and if i see if y'all if, if the reception to the uh vlog is good then I'll maybe do record some more. I'm keep looking behind me because this truck is like on my bumper, like back up. Anyway, like I was about to say about work, like I just don't want to go to work. Like I've gotten so comfortable with sitting at home doing nothing. At first, like the first month of being like um, under quarantine, like it was driving me crazy because I was only um, working one of my jobs and that was the one at night, but then when I stopped working both of them, I was like going crazy. Like, I'm just like, I can't wait for stuff to open up. I can't wait. Now I done got like settled and used to being home. I like it. <laughs> like some of the stuff is starting to like open up in Jersey. Like so far we could only have um, restaurants. We could only do um, outdoor eating. Yeah, outdoor dining. Or you could pick up your food. Um, I don't think our movie theaters are open back yet. I'm waiting on the gym. Because, like, if you follow me on my social media, you know I'm a person. I work out five days a week. Like, the gym is, like, the gym is, like, my life. And the fact that I haven't been able to, like, work out, like, really, really work out. Because, like, I could work out at home, of course, because lately I've been doing that. I finally went out and got some dumbbells. And I've been going running in the park every morning. But... To me, it's nothing like being inside of the gym, you know, because you, you're seeing other people and you watching them work out. They watch you work out. And it's like, you know, you you don't even realize it, but it's like you're motivating each other to go harder. Like when I'm at home, I'm going to half ass it. And like I was saying, I had to really force myself to go out and get dumbbells and work out because I done put on some quarantine weight and I don't like it. <laughs> Like, I do not, like, it's not that much, but I've gained, now I gained like 10 or 11 pounds. I'm not, I'm not liking it. I need to get these little 10 pounds off me. So I've been going, like I said, to the park and I've been running, forcing myself to run or I'll walk, but I'm, I don't like running. Like running on the treadmill and running outside is totally different. Like, when I leave the park in the morning, my legs be on fire. Like, my calves be hurting so bad. But what I've been doing is, like, I go I go to the park every day. But, like, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I come home and I'll do, like, um, squats. Different little exercises with the weights for my arms. Like, my back, like, you know, kind of break it up a little bit. But I cannot wait until the gym open up so I can get my it's on the stairmaster like i just can't wait to see the fucking stairmaster like i don't know sitting at home is just i don't know like it's i'm enjoying it but it's like i'm so used to also doing something every single day even though don't get me wrong like i don't want to go back <laughs> to work because I'm, i am a little bit comfortable with sitting at home but it's like I need something to kind of break up the day because like sitting at home like we've been doing the last couple months like that is boring like it's just I don't know 
like for people who don't work I don't know how anybody is able to let me close this so y'all can see me I don't know how anybody is able to sit at home like all day long seven days a week and do nothing like me with staying at home it's been getting a little bit better like I said I'm used to it because I'm going out to the park I'm working out I'm doing stuff I'm you know I have something to do but like at first like I was saying sitting at home all day I don't know how people do it and I'm not a TV watcher like I just can't sit and watch TV all day I have so many sunglasses and I'm always buying glasses, sunglasses. <sighs> Child. Is it me? Am I the only one who hate having to wear a mask out in public? Like, I hate these masks. Like, I really, really hate them. I just left out of Target. They didn't really have anything in there. Well, not what I was looking for. I wanted another t-shirt, kind of like the one I'm wearing. I think I got this from Walmart, but I thought maybe um target would have like a big variety like this but they only had like four or five let me show y'all shirts that was in my size and the ones that were in my size the ones that i like wasn't in my size so i only found this one i'm sure i could find something to wear with it and it's like i know we're supposed to keep the face mask on for you know and i got me some candy i should be eating this i know we're supposed to keep the face mask on like for our own protection and to protect other people, but having that face mask on, walking around the store looking for stuff, like it is just hot with that mask. Like I be feeling like I can't breathe with the mask on. Like, I don't know, I'm tired of wearing these masks. Like I am really tired of wearing these masks. And I know unfortunately, you know, COVID ain't going nowhere anytime soon, so. It's just something we gonna have to, I guess, live with, kind of like the new normal, but I don't like them face masks. Like, I just don't like it at all. Um, I did want to go to home goods, but I think I need to be working. I should, well, I'm supposed to be working, not going from store to store, but like I said, I only got one case, so I'm kind of like, you know, <laughs> doing what I want, so. <laughs> Yeah, if I go to my home goods, then I'll probably record. But yeah, I'm about to actually go start working. <laughs> okay, now, so I am about to probably go to the mall because I just actually had to go to, I'm not sure exactly like how to, I don't know how they're doing this shit, but um. Basically, I work for the, during the day. I work for like this uh, company or whatever, and it's kind of like I am a support coordinator or whatever. But anyway, I just had to go like fill out um, all these papers for like one of my cases because one of my cases, the girl she um, goes to the gym or whatever. She goes to like it's a it's a little private gym. It's not like a um, what you call it like a gym chain or whatever like kind of like planet fitness retro where how they got them like everywhere every city it's not like that it's like a, a a small um gym or whatever and here she um like i was saying i lost my train of thought she works out here or whatever and in jersey it's like the gyms are closed like the governor the state has not opened up the gym facilities but she is a my company is allowing her to come to get personal training and i'm trying to figure out how that's going to work because she like the funding from my company whatever it comes from the state and it's like i i don't understand like how they 
Like how this, <laughs> I can't even get my words out. Like I don't understand like how they agreeing, like how, where are they getting the funds for her to come work out when quote unquote, it is illegal for gyms to be open. We're like, if, let's just say if the city or town where we at, if they found out that this place was open, like they could be shut down by the state. So it was like the fact that my company <laughs> is getting funds from the state for her to come work out when the, i don't know hopefully y'all get what i'm saying hopefully i'm making sense because sometimes when i talk i don't be making sense <laughs> that sounds terrible but y'all get what i'm saying it's like this place is not supposed to be open like it is statewide that the gyms are not open but my company is getting money from the state to pay for her to come here to work out it's like i don't i don't understand that I mean, it's above me. <laughs> I am about to go to the mall, and I'm probably gonna go. Probably gonna go get something to eat. I need clothes. I mean, I don't need clothes, but I do need clothes. See, I'm not making sense again. It's like all my clothes that I got now that I'm getting older. Some things like it's just not like I don't know like. I will feel weird like having wearing certain things like crop tops or just different things being that I have a a teenage son like my son is going to be 14 in September it's like I don't know like I don't want to I feel like I'm I don't want to be dressed like I'm going to high school with him bad enough so I just got to the mall and it's crazy like all of the entrances is not even open where you have to go to a certain door to get in like that's just crazy but whatever i don't know it's like the mall just looks so depressing with nothing hardly open I don't see nothing in here I like. <laughs> hey, I'm home and I wanted to show y'all what I got from the mall. I got these pants out of Express. Actually, they were on sale for, well, the sale tax is $39.99, but I ended up paying $16 dollars for this. Let me show y'all what else I have. Um, I got these pants. Oh, hold on. I, I tried them on a few minutes ago. But... Oh, and I went back to Target also on my way to the mall. And I got these pants right here from Target. They were like $25. I got th these jeans out of HM. These were like $10, I believe. And I know I said that long speech in the car, how I want to stay out of jeans and dress older. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw those jeans and I was like, I got to have them. This is the shirt I got out of Target. This was like $8, I believe. And I got this shirt from H&M. This is really cute. You can't really see it out. Got the shirt all inside out. That's what that looks like. And the ties at the bottom. Right here, this is really cute. I was like so confused with some of the stuff I got in Express. Um. Because I got these pants right here, size 10. And at first, I didn't think I was going to be able to fit them. Because like I was saying, I think in the, earlier, I gained some weight. So, And you know now with COVID going on, you can't try nothing on the store. So, I ended up getting these shorts in a size 12. Because I don't know why I'm thinking like a size 10, I'm not going to be able to fit. 
but I tried these shorts on. They're kind of big, but I could make them work. These are like um, high rise shorts. These are so cute on, and they tie. Got the belt that ties. And I got this black shirt that goes with it. And I got this little pink, um, what you call these shirts? Camisole, I believe that's the name of it. And I got this shirt in the medium. And I ended up getting this in the large. So, yeah. I am about to go to bed. I just wanted to show y'all what I got really, really quick. I got some other stuff from Target, but it's over. I just put it back in the bag because I'm going to take it back because I don't like how it fit. But. Yeah. <laughs>